welcome back to the video. This one is going to be a little different. I thought I would do a little behind the scenes, um, like a studio vlog, a first ever studio vlog, I guess. Sorry for how I look. I just got out of the shower and I needed to wash out my makeup because I've had it on for a few days. Probably look a little crazy. I'm sorry. Um, I don't actually know even if this is a good angle, um, but I hope so. I'm using my GoPro to shoot this. So it is Sunday, um, January 19th. I just uploaded my black watercolor paper video, um, but I just have my analytics up, so I'm watching um, the activity on that video. And just hanging out today because it has not stopped snowing. I can show you. So I don't know if you can see how much it's coming down. The dogs are out there. But it has been snowing like this for almost two days straight now, I think. So one thing, one thing that I wanted to do today was make some test out some stickers this is a painting that I will be posting it's, I, this was probably the previous video video when this one goes up um, so if you haven't seen that I can link it above for you to check out but I painted this and I wanted to try making this into a sticker and white glossy and then I have some white matte paper um, so I want to do a sheet of each and see which one I like I'm gonna um, scan it in and shrink it and I think I'm gonna try to go for um, a circle sticker probably I don't know I don't know how big I can get it so I will take you along with that um, oh but before we do that my studio room has kind of changed um, and rearranged a little and I got some new additions that I guess I wanted to show here in a vlog rather than on a video um, because I guess it's more like behind the scenes so well, let me show you that so over here which is a mess um, you already saw my Cricut but underneath or behind all these <laughs> shaders that I got for Christmas um, is a art printer so it also scans so I want to scan in the artwork and print it out and then um, use my Cricut to test out the stickers um, and then I also move my desk so in my studio tour a couple videos ago I had the desk over here but I moved it over here because my boyfriend built me a custom computer for Christmas. How awesome is this? So this is the front. It's kind of got a polygon um, texture to it. It kind of, the case comes out a little like a bump. Um, it's got a magnetic screen up here to catch dust, um, the power button and a couple of ports. And then here, I don't know if you can tell, but he secretly used my Cricut to cut out a stencil of my name and used some glass etching cream to make this, which was so cool. And then you can open it, which is really neat. Um, so if you ever need to change anything or fix anything. So here's inside my computer. I have it on the RGB setting, but literally everything in here, everything with lights is customizable down to the individual LED on each fan. So I got two fans up there, the back fan, my liquid cooler, this is my RAM, I got two more fans up front, this is my graphics card with a custom back plate. So you guys are literally in my computer right now. That's such a cool shot. It looks so pretty. I love having this on at night. It's like a little night light. So that is my newest addition and why I kind of got backed up making videos because we were waiting for pieces to come in. And then I got 
Oh, he also got me this keyboard, which has different light settings as well. There's like something like 20 different settings. Oh, that one just does that. Crazy. Just solid color. And you can hit another key and change what color it shows. So this is my favorite one right now. I'm also getting a new chair tomorrow that I'm excited about. It's white and silver to match my room. And it should be delivered tomorrow so I can show you when I put that together. Morning guys, it is 
Monday, January 20th. I have today off of work. So last night I did some testing with stickers on the Cricut. So I have quite a few here. I don't know if you can see. Let me show you. So this was my first batch I did on matte sticker paper and I didn't like the color. Um, the, the colors were off and also the quality wasn't very good. And this was on matte and then this was the um, glossy paper. So I looked and the print settings we're just doing the default. Um, I had to go into the advanced settings and choose like photo quality so I could get a better print. Um, and then I noticed it was slightly off. These I trimmed a little by hand, um, but I noticed they were slightly off. So I thought maybe the machine had to be calibrated. So we fixed the printing issue. So now this is I went off of a photo rather than a scan because I'm still working on the scan settings. So this is a photo I took of it and I printed it on the glossy paper but it was still off a lot and I was really confused and my boyfriend was trying to help me and we couldn't figure it out so we did some research because I hear about people who have the issue a lot about um, the sticker, the like cuts not lining up correctly. Well, from what I have gathered and tested last night is the glossy paper was so shiny that the sensor on the Cricut wasn't picking up the cut lines correctly. Um, and so we tested it again on the matte paper and these worked perfectly. These are perfect circles. So I'm not, I don't know how to say this, but I don't think the sticker looks as good on the matte paper. Um, so I read a couple tricks about the glossy paper um, that I can try with the Cricut. So I think I'm going to try that again. Um, but this is what I did last night so it's all still a work in progress so today I think we're gonna go um, snow tubing with my friend and her daughter which is my goddaughter so I'm excited to do that and I will try to charge up my GoPro and bring that along with us so that should be fun my chair should be delivered today, so I'm excited for my new chair. I did take tomorrow off of work, so I will have another day off. Hey guys, good morning. It is Tuesday the 21st and so yesterday 
We went tubing and then afterwards I had an appointment, grabbed some Chinese, we had dinner, and then I ended up falling asleep pretty early. So I didn't get to put my chair together, so I wanted to do that today. So I also have you at a different angle, so now you're on top of my monitor. I don't know how it looks, so hopefully it's a little bit of a different background, I figured. And I have my dog today, so I'm excited um, to have him, and he'll help me hang out in the studio and build my chair. So let's get out of this creepy old wooden chair. 